Hey, what's up everybody? Akeem here and in today's Fix of Entertainment News, we discuss the upcoming Until Dawn movie, Master Chief having romantic relations without his helmet on in the Halo live action series, and more Demon Slayer is coming to theaters. This is your Entertainment Fix. Now Hollywood is back at it again, this time adapting another video game into a feature length film. Now PlayStation Productions is teaming up with filmmaker David F. Sandberg and Gary Doberman to bring the pixels of the interactive horror game Until Dawn to the big screen. Now Sandberg will be helming the movie with Doberman taking a pass at the script. Now Doberman's no slouch when it comes to panning horror flicks as he's worked on The Nun and Annabelle movie franchises. Now director Sandberg also worked on horror movies back in the past before switching it up and getting caught in the whole superhero movie machine working on both Shazam movies. Now for those unfamiliar with the video game, Until Dawn is a choose your own adventure, quick time events type horror video game where you take on the role of eight friends who are trying to survive the perils of Blackwood Mountain Until Dawn. Hence the name Until Dawn. Yeah. Now, the video game has quite the star-studded cast, with the likes of Rami Malek, Jordan Fisher, and many others who all honestly could be priced their roles in the live-action movie. And since the developers also used their likenesses for each character, it honestly would be kind of hard for the movie to announce a cast that didn't contain any of the original cast from the game. It's literally their faces. Now also it'd be a great way to connect the film to the video game and possibly drum up renewed interest in the game, thus possibly leading to more sales or even a remastered version for the PS5. Uh, we've seen this done with The Last of Us Parts 1 and 2 receiving remastered versions, so it's not like it's necessarily out of the realm of possibility for PlayStation to follow suit if this movie is in fact a box office hit. But until then, Until Dawn is set to release sometime in the future. And we'll keep you posted when more news breaks. And for you anime fans out there, Demon Slayer is coming to theaters this February with a new movie. Now, it's not necessarily a movie per se, more just two episodes rolled into one seamlessly theatrical experience for fans to enjoy. So the Hashira training is coming to theaters across the globe next month, which will contain the Swordsmith Village arc finale and a sneak peek at the Hashira training arc's first episode. The dates are actually staggered for certain regions, but it'll be rolled out February 21st through the 27th, with the World Tour kicking off February 10th in New York. Now you can find out more info on Crunchyroll's website and find out how to buy tickets for the screening. And finally, the actor who played Master Chief in the Halo live action series thinks it was a big mistake having the character get it on in the series. And you know what I mean when I say get it on, yeah. Actor Pablo Schreiber said, quote, the decision to make the connection between Maki and John a romantic connection was a huge mistake. I felt it was a huge mistake at the time and I argued against it and fought against it. But I am who I am. I don't write the scripts. I only give my opinion. It wasn't listened to. Well, I'm sure, you know, there are a lot of fans out there who write fan fiction about Master Chief, so they could have just been catering to a certain audience. Also, you know, a chief has needs, so let them cook. And I'm not just talking about on the battlefield. You know what I mean, baby, in them bed sheets. But you know what? He should definitely put the helmet back on for added protection. And you know what I mean, yeah, in the bed sheets. And that about does it for today's Fix of Entertainment news. I'm Akeem Lawanson. Thank you for watching. Now that you're caught up on today's news, please check out our previous video. Download the IGN app on all your devices. And for everything else, stick with IGN.